100 years. So what did we need to do in order to create this, this uh, blueprint? Can you guys see? It's okay or should we shut this first bank of lights off? I totally forgot about that. Is it okay? Okay. So there was all sorts of things that we had to incorporate in here. And because we wanted this to be a very holistic plan to, to meet as many of the objectives and goals in the management plan as possible, we had to bring in a whole bunch of information. So we did a master drainage plan that uh, looked at the engineering solutions for flooding and erosion. We had a lot of discussion and conversations about land use, uh, looked at a lot of different low impact development and as well as the creek corridor, the, the specific reaches. We looked at the social considerations. There was quite a discussion about some, some of these items are going to be big cost items, so how do, we, how do we balance the economic and the environmental, the economic costs and the environmental benefits and, and maybe the social benefits. Um, greenways, areas for recreation, areas, green spaces, that was all talked about. And then we had environmental considerations where we, we did some very specific studies on, on the creek. We did a proper functioning condition assessment. We went through and uh, developed restoration prescriptions for all of the open sections of the creek. We did some benthic, water monitor, benthic monitoring as well as water quality monitoring and we assessed all of the riparian habitat in the open sections of the creek. So all of this information came together 